Sounds like those raiders at Libertalia were quite a handful. Nice work bringing that rogue synth back. What took our five so long to reach you? You must act now. The Brotherhood of Steel has discovered the location of the railroad. I'll warn them right away. Thank you. I was hoping for more time to organize a rebellion, but it's clear we cannot delay. Once you secure the railroad against the Brotherhood, tell your people we are ready to fight. Go. Now! going to do this. I don't know how yet, but we're going to rescue people. Z1's rebellion is ready, but we have a crisis. The Brotherhood's on their way here. What? What are you talking about? Oh, you're still alive. I got here in time. Jesus. Quick, take this. Tom made it for you. Sounds like we're going to need it. Everyone else, mobilize. We got Brotherhood incoming. Defensive position. Jesus. Reinforce glory in the tunnels. Move! Move! Damn! The fool attempted to escape from the floor. Jessica, she's fine. She almost Wait, what was that? Target located. <laughs> oh, lost someone. Brothers. Jesus. Desdemona. We're cut off. Glory told them off. The Don't catacombs are now our only about, way out. We got lucky so far. No one's died. Your warning saved us. Thank God for that. You and the others go help Glory. Win that fight, or we're all dead. Des will get us through this. She always does. None of them got past me. Damn, that stings. Listen, the railroad's always sitting on its hand. Ah! You're the best thing that's ever happened. Promise me you'll free them. All of them. Hold on. You'll make it through. Bullshit. Isn't there... Isn't there supposed to be a light? Standing down. Got the 
Hey. I leave HQ for a second, and that's when the Brotherhood hits us. Damn it! You must have beat them, though. Their vertebrates just bugged out. How bad was it down there? Glory's dead. Shit, Glory? This is a nightmare. Hopefully Dez knows our next move. Talk with her. Hey. You've killed the last of them, and you're still standing. I wish the same could be said for Glory. No time for that, though. The Brotherhood underestimated us badly. Their next attack will be far, far worse. So we do the unexpected. We eliminate the Brotherhood as a threat now, and the key to that is destroying their flying fortress, the Pridwin. Fortunately, we've got a contingency plan for that. Tom, we're activating Operation Red Glare. What? But Red Glare requires a Brotherhood vertebrate. Then Bullseye will get you one. Count on me. With what happened to Glory, we need you more than ever. Thanks for stepping up. The Brotherhoods occupied the Cambridge police station. Spotters report they almost always have a vertebrate parked on its roof. Take it. And Tom, you're going with him. Me? In the field? No one else can fly the damn thing. This one's for Glory. Move out. Hello. Man, how do you live up here? There is a million ways we could be monitored right now. By the Brotherhood or, you know. About the mission, Tom. The police station is crawling with Brotherhood guys. At least one in power armor. But as promised, they got a vertebrate on the roof. You really up for this? Let's go. Prepping that vertebrate for takeoff is gonna take me a few minutes. So first, we gotta clear the police station of hostiles. I can't believe I'm doing this. Heck, what was that? Prisoners. Yes. 
Hey. See what I got in my bag. Back before I met you, I'd go whole days without massacring a bunch of things. Honestly. Sounding all clear. Team up with a mortuary. You see where I'm going with this, right? We got fun time in time. You. We got ourselves some wheels. Oh, or wings, or whatever this is. Here's the deal. After flight prep, we take the vertebrate up to the Pridwin and dock. From the inside, the blimp's vulnerable. To keep that baby afloat, it's got massive gas bags full of hydro jet. Tell me about my role in this. Your job is tricky. You gotta find a way to place these explosives on the gas bags. Then get the hell back to our vertebrae. Make it to a comfortable distance, then it's bye-bye pretty. Flight prep is going to take time. And the Brotherhood's not just going to give it to us. So if paladins show up, keep them off me and the bird. So the manual said right. Okay. Where's the master switch? Man, we've got a vertebrate incoming. Oil Shit. Pressure. Check. Oh, shit. I'm going as fast as I can in here. But I don't know what... What's this panel even do? Throttle. Full open. Insert something Shakespearean involving death and your inevitable doom here.
Excuse me. First things first. I picked up some Brotherhood goodies for you. Merry Christmas. More importantly, though, Tinker's ready for us on the bird. Let's go. Falling off a log. Dear God, we're dead. Well, with your colorful history with the Brotherhood, as soon as they spot you, it's game time. So maybe you can play the sneak card. I got you this stealth boy for what it's worth. Odds are you'll get made. Once that happens, I'd run my and somehow get out alive. It's gonna be one hell of a firefight. When we land, Tinker's gonna keep the bird of bird school for an immediate takeoff. And my job is to be Tom's lookout and make sure any looky loos keep walking. Tom, we're getting closer to the blimp. Can you fly just a little straighter? Deacon, man, I'm trying. If you want to give it a whirl, I won't stop. No, 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 you're doing great, Tom. Just keep her a little more steady. Yeah, 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 I got you. Scabbard, this is Claymore requesting clearance. Claymore, you're cleared for launch bay three. Deck officer is requesting an update on the police station. Uh, hostiles eliminated. Scimitar status. Confirm. Scimitar took some fire. Uh, should be up and running in a few hours. We have a visual on you, Claymore. Your docking port's not open. Got some technical difficulties with the port thingy. Working on it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, but, but, but what button is it? Uh, there? Claymore, you're clear for approach. Get your bets in. I sure did. Don't take too long in there. If anyone comes over here, I don't know if I can fool them. Good luck.
Something got me. Come here! Let me end your suffering! Attention. Tomorrow's tactical briefing has been postponed. A new time and date will be forthcoming. <laughs>
out of blast range now. Here goes nothing. Shit! Whoa. That's a hell of a thing. Rest easy. Des has something urgent for you. This is gonna be one hell of a ride. I thought... I thought by calling Red Glare I'd lose more good people. Comrades, thank you for keeping them, and yourself, safe. We still lost too many people. Without you, though, it would have been far worse. But we're not out of the woods yet. If the Brotherhood managed to find us, you can bet your ass the SRB is not far behind. We've run out of time. Our next step is to attack the Institute. Here, that rogue synth of the Bataya was a real menace. Glad it's back where it belongs. Ah, there you are. You've met with the director. I assume they made their intentions known? It was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility. What about you? Do you agree with their decision? It's the only way we can ensure the Institute's safety. That makes it the right thing to do. I'm glad you agree. None what comes next will be easy. That conviction may help keep us all going. You know, Father, it's no secret that you worked with the Railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? They mean nothing to me. Never have. I'll admit, I'm relieved to hear that. Then I certainly hope I can count on you for what needs to be done. 
because these fanatics cannot be allowed to continue to exist. They represent a very clear threat to the Institute. Small as they are in number, their twisted ideology ensures that they will never stop trying to strike at us. They must be eradicated. Are you willing to see to it? You don't have to worry about them any longer. They're as good as dead. Thank you. Do what needs to be done, but keep yourself safe. Desdemona has an op for you. plans. Hello, Sean. Ah. Uh, there you are. I've already heard the news. But of course, you wouldn't be here if it weren't a success. I'm glad it worked, but... I'm glad you're safe. We're all safe now. For now. Yes, but... There will always be threats. You must remain vigilant. Ali has always been loyal to the Institute, and to me. You can rely on her for help. Once I'm gone, it's all up to you. I'll do my best. I know you will. Don't worry about me. You need to look ahead. Focus on the future. Our time together has been... strange, hasn't it? I spent years wondering what you were like. Thinking about all we missed out on, I want you to know that I'm grateful for the time we've had. I'm glad I found you. As am I. Thank you. Father, you've helped a boy achieve his dreams. I think... I think I'd like to sleep now. I've lost Sean, all over again. I close my eyes, I see my life before all of this, before the bombs. Everything can change in an instant, 
and the future you plan for yourself shifts whether or not you're ready. At some point, it happens to all of us. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. The Commonwealth. My home. Ripped apart and put back together. I thought, I hoped, I could find my family, cheat time, make us whole again. The way we were. But now I know. I know I can't go back. I know the world has changed. That the road ahead will be hard. This time, I'm ready. Because I know war. War never changes.